Hello everyone and welcome to another video. It is six weeks since I have last checked the eBay auctions and today, yeah, well, I have taken the top 20, well, top 20, the most expensive ones that actually have sold within the last six weeks since August 2nd. So, um, we're just going to look, take a look at it. This is the Scar for a Scar playset, Flesh and Blood promos, three uh, best offer accepted $1,800 from Vermont in the US. And then, next up, Storm Striders. This is a 9.5 packet. Was sold for $1,825 plus shipping. They came from Massachusetts in the US. And then we've had Houston, Texas, United States. Then we've had a Arcanet School Cap 9.5. That, of course, is the first edition. And a 9.5 packet. That is a pretty, pretty decent grade. Um, yeah, we're already at $1,900 for one Arcan Rising sealed box that came from... Where is it at? Where does it say? Uh, Texas, US as well. So, $1,900. Someday somebody's going to open that uh, this right here is a collection you see that looks so good all these magnetic cases with the heart of fjandal and the front that's a bunch of cards uh, raw um, in sleeves in cases i mean plastic cases so we would have to go to the wow description down here which said that includes foil rares, super rares, foil rares, majestics, foil majestics, cold foils of every rarity, and then legendary items, rainbow and cold foil, and fable items, rainbow and cold foil. So, I mean, if you look at those pictures, you know, there is a bunch of cool stuff in there. I did not calculate this through. There might be somebody who made a good deal, 1925 from India, US. And then another Arcan Rising first box sealed from Texas. Maxwell as well again. That is a hefty price. 2000 Best offer accepted. And then $2,007 for the Welcome to Wrath Alpha. That is rainbow foil. That is ungraded. That says lightly played excellent. Came from California, more than two thousand dollars. That is just it's a good price. So hold on, this is the same, I guess. Is it? Isn't it? Who's the seller? Berklex. Berklex. That's the same. Yeah, that's the same. It just added that another time. I don't know how that happens all the time. That is, that's the same, right? Anyways, so next. Um, uh, Mask of Momentum, 9.5 packet, that is the Alpha, of course, it sold for $2,094 from Massachusetts in the US, and now it gets even more pricey and ridiculous. So we have a, a little damaged box, wow, this is a welcome to Ralph Alpha, N oh my, oh my god, $2,500 from New York for this little box. I mean, what's supposed to happen, huh? Well, that's a bit much, but anyways, 2500 for that. Welcome to Ratha box. Um, that looks much better. That came from Carolina, Puerto Rico. Puerto Rico, as we all learned, is up there as well. And now, I don't know why. There's so many booster boxes sold in the last weeks. This is a Welcome to Ralph Alpha $2,600 from Puerto Rico as well. Now we have a Welcome to Ralph sealed in a pretty decent condition yeah, for $2,800. Came from Colorado, Denver. And then uh, we've had this bundle right here. So we can see Welcome to Ralph, Arkin Rising two times, three times, 
that's cases um, oh this is Belgian yeah that's Belgian print and this one is here is Japan print one two three times welcome to wrath so four in total then we have crew two times one oh that's both Japan I just didn't see that is that opened are these uh, another welcome to Roth. Now welcome to Roth. Check this out. This is just that's quite a bunch. So um, three R cases, uh, six Roth cases, and two crew unlimited cases. So that three thousand six hundred dollars from Georgia, U.S. So U.S. very very active. This one came from Hawaii. The best offer was accepted. Three thousand eight hundred fifty was the original price. A welcome to Roth. Alpha box um, that doesn't look too much better than the others, but still, we don't know what the price was, which was accepted. So, oh, this is four thousand two hundred fourteen dollars from Canada, <laughs> Canada in Canada. All right, interesting. So that's two sealed boxes of Welcome to Wrath first. That seems to be a good deal compared to the rest, but I don't know about. Is it customs, taxes, fees, something? I don't know. So, four more to go. Check this out. $4,500. Somebody paid this price for a raw Eye of Ophelia first edition. This is just, that's great stuff. This came from Wisconsin. And now we have the top three. $7,500. For the PCG 9 Fiandra Spring Tunic Alpha. So, um, yeah, as you all know, I'm going to get some cards graded at the end of this month. I'm going to prepare a video before and after, of course. I'm going to unpack this, I guess, in a video or even live when they come back. That uh, would be uh, my first big grading submission. So, um, yeah, that's great. I mean, this came from uh, Australia. Seven thousand five hundred. Right, we have another one. Eleven thousand one hundred dollars for this nine point five Heart of Fienda graded by Beckett Alpha Edition. Oh, the corners are nine. This came from Massachusetts as well, and um, yeah, there is nothing else to say about this. This is a this is a masterpiece. This is two. 99.9% .9 of all the collectors that would be the most expensive card and then here is the the top most expensive one of the last month or the last six weeks this is the Eye of Ophelia this was graded at 10 by PSA so probably might not have gotten a not might not have gotten a 10 with PCG anyways it's going to look very very clear I mean what is this that's only on the case I guess um, we have no subgrades I don't know anything about that but uh, this is an eye of Ophelia graded alpha just first edition Arcane Rising 11,200 came from Arizona and um, yeah that was the most expensive one so if anybody said there's nothing going on this summer just check this out these have actually sold 11,000 seven thousand four thousand this is just there is there is a lot going on with the big whales i as the little shrimp i don't even have a single card which is worth a thousand bucks so that one right there would top everything everything by far that i have um yeah hey, interesting look interesting to see that uh thanks for watching thanks for um being being here on my channel and taking the time to check all the stuff out that I check out and I'm going to talk to you in the next video thanks a lot thanks a lot for being here goodbye where do I stop this video now here here bye